Hello, this is Richard. This is Games Freezer. Today we're back with another 10 minute taster. We're over on the PC and we are playing a game called Slave Zero X, which is uh, from the Steam page, is a stylish 2.5D character action game set in the biopunk world of Slave Zero, 1999. Basically run and slash your way through a dystopian future in this character action game which will resonate with fans of Devil May Cry, Strider and Guilty Gear. So, looks as though it hits a few checkboxes for a lot of people. So, I am going to play this for the first time and see how it looks and how it plays. And uh, you can get a bit of an indication as to what it plays like. So, let's see what happens, shall we? very cool looking presentation to it I mean I've looked at some some of the screenshots it's uh, looks like an awesome game this is giving me vibes of uh, Metal Gear Solid walking down this corridor half expect to hide behind that pipe there and wait for a guard to come around huh? Very cinematic, I like this. Can't be a good corridor shot. Show, what are you doing here? The master wants to see you. Hmm? What for? I think he's finally made his choice. You mean me? Are you sure? I'm to cover your shift while you speak with him. I don't believe it. Okay. I should go. Show. I'm going to finish what Isamu started. I promise. So I'm not in control of any of this at the minute. It's all on rails. Ouch. Light attacks. X for a light attack on the ground or in the air. Repeatedly for a combo. Try pressing light attack while holding different directions on the ground or in the air. Okay. Y for a heavy attack. Light, heavy, light, heavy. Okay. Try pressing heavy attack while holding different directions. Double tap a direction to run. Press down to slide. Press A to jump, you can double jump. I'll press an A again. Many attacks can be interrupted, cancelled by jumping. This can also be done during some airborne attacks if you can double jump. Or after dive kicking, try jumping to recover or extend your combo. Current health is displayed on the topmost bar on your HUD. Don't lose your life. Current meter is displayed on the second bar on your HUD. Uh, use this to empower yourself for your moves, okay? If you're able to burst the orb in your HUD, if you're able to burst, the orb in your HUD will be glowing brightly. Use this to escape the enemy or burst an attack to refill your meter. During your adventure you will find various items you can use against your enemies. Small circles next to your burst orb show how much ammo of each you have left. If you attack enemies, you'll gain meter. You can use your meter to empower your attacks. When you use a light attack and then use your heavy attack in quick succession, you form an X move. She will flash blue when you successfully make your attack an X move. Okay. Shell can use an X move to cancel the usual recovery of a normal move. It's a lot of information considering I haven't touched the uh, character yet or been in control of anything. Right, okay. And still your fatal sync when your meter is at 100% glowing gold you can use your fatal sync rb when active you'll be surrounded by a golden halo and your meter will drain over time x moves are free during fatal sync your attacks still life from your enemies no the burst orb may be your most important resource in slave zero x you can only use a burst orb when it's full okay use your burst orb to knock enemies away in 
while being hit by them you will glow blue to do this press the shortcut L so it's L3 button I think or light X plus heavy plus fatal sync RB together I think the shortcut is the one isn't it press L down All right, okay oh no you can burst but you can use the burst orb to gain 100% meter make any attack and immediately use burst when you attack animation you will glow gold you can use your fatal sync with 100% meter this would have been better done with a um, an actual tutorial where you get to do these moves but we'll see during your adventure you'll find various items you can use against your enemies the small circles next to your burst orb will show how much stock you have left to throw ordnance enemies such as grenades press RT to change your current ordinance ordinance press B you can only carry a limited number of ordnance the stock is uh, displayed in your HUD each munition type has unique capabilities so try them out okay LB dodge parry towards the attacking enemy to parry Right, I'm going to be rubbish at this, I can tell already, but I'm giving it a go. Please, I'm sorry. Is this like a um, kind of venom type situation where I've been overtaken by this thing in a jar? Right, you but idiot junkie, she's still not shared from still. This cheap shit barely hits me. Take some more of that. Not right, you'll be using it. <sighs> Justice is divine. Hold X to skip. I don't want to skip. Wow. More. More. It's kind of a deliberateness to the animation, isn't there? Unit seven. I need Berman to report. It's a strange feeling, I thought it was going to be like a light sort of um, game, you know, like very free flowing. It feels kind of very slow and precise. But then it does say press the same direction Unit seven. twice to run, right? Have I got to come down here? So it's on rails, so I can't really go anywhere else other than where it's asking me to go. But what do I do? All right. It's a weird um, advantage. It's almost like Final Fight, if I'm honest. The feeling I get. It's like a side scroller, but without. With like on a sort of two and a half D plane, I suppose that's where they get the two and a half D from, maybe. It's nice. That's pretty cool. I like this. That's impossible, Unit 8. You must be mistaken. <laughs> this is just fun. Pure fun. Let's see if I can look out some... Oh, that's cool. I could kick. So push up and press light attack. 
Although these early enemies don't seem to do much offensive maneuvers anyway. They're almost just like fodder for me to get used to. Unit 8, what is your status? Unit 8? Cho! Cho! What have you done? Shut that off. Wow. That's pretty cool. Just trying to see what else I can do. Is there a double? Oh yeah, two buttons at the same time, that's nice. Highest combo 7 style B, damage taken 0, enemy slain 8. So I think I've been transformed into this by that thing that came out of the uh, glass jar. It appears anyway. lot of uh, button bashing going on in terms of X and Y. So what else can I do? I can do... When my meat is full, I think I can do that burst thing. So I'll try that in a minute. like a way of getting out of um, a sticky situation I think. This is my first time I've been hit. Knock up on me. Ah, oh, here we go. Look, this is where I should have used my burst when I was surrounded. Look, those guys block. Oh, see if I can parry. It's pretty cool. I love the presentation. I mean, it's very stylish. Clear C. Damage 6. Right, continue or shop? What's in the shop? Sometimes I dream about cheese. Yeah, this is true. I've got some cash. Munitions, customizations, go upgrades, max health. I haven't got enough for any of that. Munitions, quick restock, health pack, IED. Right, let's go health pack. Let's say our finest customer shop till you drop achievement. Not bad. Okay, what else have we got? Uh, munitions, customization. Okay, red devil. What's chronicle? Maybe that'll show me what's gone on so far. Okay, nothing there yet. Right, let's get out of that. Press A to confirm. Oh, what I want to do, continue. Onwards and downwards. The burst can be used while being attacked to break out or used during a combo to regain all meter. Okay. Bosh, bosh. 
blood and meat, guts, entrails, corpses and carrion. Quite the blossoming vocabulary. The slave learns quickly. The pilot knows many. March so lot. So, I know you can hear me. Have you lost your mind? This wasn't the plan. The master is furious. The master is furious. Is that? It, it can talk. Switch comm channels. Goodbye. This is a bloodbath here. <laughs> wow, nice kick. Shame you can't finish him while they're on the floor. Maybe you can. So you're going to have to wait for him to get up, I think. That's what it seems like. Oh, here comes this dude. Look, they take one hit. And that's a light hit. These guys take about three or four hits, don't they? So if I'm running, I can pull down and slide in. Kind of maneuver myself around. Get used to running. Whoa, here comes my first mini boss. If I can just tempt him round. That angle is a bit weird, isn't it? I need to get him down here. Stop. Oh yeah, they're pretty easy. I mean, as long as you stay out of the range of that hammer that I got hit with a couple of times there. Ooh, he's trying to turn back. Kind of like a nice little kick. Like that. Dealt with. Very cool, very cool. Rank E, I'm not very good at it, but I'm getting the job done. It's like a halfway point, I'm assuming. So down these steps. Interesting camera angle choice, you know. Guys are gonna come down. That's quite cool. Press a supply pod. What is it doing? Press here? interact to, to aid shop. the climb of my chosen one. Now they're fated to be squandered by you. <laughs> you were never going to choose another master. You despise the Biomecha. Their dark science is the same that keeps you breathing. 
If I hadn't acted... Act? All you do is act. Reckless. With no ability to see things through to their obvious end. This ends atop the megacity, with the Sovkan's head in my hands. If you think Isamu would have... The pilot defies the master. He's not my master anymore. Hmm. There you go. What's my interact button then? Ah, B. Masterworks. All. Can't go wrong. Masterworks all. Can't go wrong. Okay. What we've got now? 4,600. Don't think I can afford anything in there yet. So onwards we go. I've got to admit, I find it hard to click into the double, double tap on the run. Whoa, check him out. Press that by mistake. Oh, do you know what I haven't done? I haven't dashed. It's all going on here and I don't have a clue. <laughs> so whatever works, works, you know. Probably wasting these... Uh, Hello mate, you alright? Take cover! Not the nicest of places. Pretty grim. It's got like this um, PlayStation 1 aesthetic in the background and this kind of, uh, this kind of pixel art in the foreground. It's quite cool. Spinning around. You know, match for me. Juggling these behemoths, turn twenty into twenty enemies into a red fine mist. That's my next achievement. Not bad. Oh, here we go. First boss. It's like a cross between. Oh. Skeletor and um, ooh, Shredder. It's got gun. That's not fair. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Like that. Right. Continue. Okay. I think I'm gonna call a halt to it right about there. Obviously, I'll have another go at this level. Um, Hopefully you've enjoyed the 10 minute taster because I've really enjoyed playing this one. Um, if you've enjoyed it, please press like. Is there any way I can block that? There is a way I can parry it, right? Yeah, please press like, subscribe to the channel. Um, oh, I'm sort of concentrating here. Subscribe to the channel. Also, uh, head over to Twitter and Instagram. At Games Freezer, uh, also over oof, on on TikTok, 
and that is the game's freezer. That's pretty good. Oh yes, got a free hit combo on him. Um, we're also over at www. which is where we put everything we do. Ah, oh, until next time, my friends. You'll be leaving me in a bag of bones. Goodbye.